Do you know where we're going? Right now, we have to hide. Arthur and I know a place. And Lucas, he's waiting at your chateau. All in good time. We're going to see Lucas again? <laughs> I hope so. I like Lucas. He's nice. Save your breath, Hugo. We're on the right track. Let's keep moving. We're not safe yet. Tell me, what the hell are you doing with the Inquisition after you? What's so special about the little guy? It's complicated. And what about your brother? Will he be all right? He'll catch up with us. He really saved our lives. It was incredible. Hey, don't get all lovey-dovey. He'll break your poor little heart. Uh, I, uh, no. Hey, I'm in. Yeah, we're going to use it to cross. What? I'll do it. Open. Oh, a big wheel. It's for crushing the wheat. Too strong. How are we going to get across? By stopping it. And how are you going to stop it? Amicia, we'll find a way. Over to you, Melly. All right. The current's slowing down, but not enough. There must be something else. No, stop. Yes. And there you go. See? Simple. If the Inquisition make it this far, that'll hold them up for a while. to impress me or what? No. All right, come on. It's pretty here, and it smells like earth. The Aki Duck, is that where Lucas is? I hope so. 
I doubt this castle is going to look like much. Why? This used to be a village, but it was reduced to rubble in just one night, years ago. Some say there's a curse around these parts. Monsieur? She's joking, Hugo. Of course I am. Since when do I say anything true, eh? Amicia. Hugo, <laughs> what are you doing? Come here. Oh. oh. Hugo? Hugo, look at me. Is it starting again? Your head. It's like... Somebody's going inside. My legs... My legs are shaking. Don't say he's been bitten. <laughs> it's not the bite. It's something in his blood since he was little. I'll have to carry him. Climb on my back if you can. Come on. <sighs> Sorry. Don't worry. If it's in his blood. What about you? I'm fine. Lucas is trying to slow the effects down. That's also why we're going to the chateau. Amicia. I'm scared. Of what, Hugo? What's in my head? Don't worry. We're all scared of what's in our heads. Here we are. You'll be able to rest. At last. Help me lift this. I'm coming. Hugo, can you climb down, please? It's a hideout, lad. It's meant for hiding out, not banquets with lords and ladies. Don't touch that. It's my brother's. That's worth a lot, that is. How long have you been living like this? Like ruffians and beggars, you mean. Family tradition. Our dad was a piece of rubbish. Tried to beat us one time too many, so we skedaddled. But you, you're almost royalty. Royalty? <laughs> Monsieur... What does ha huh mean? I'm cold. Can't you see? Look at us. We've lost everything. What do you mean? Who's going to pay us then? What are you talking about? Your mate's Lucas. He said you're rich. Just I... forget it, all right? Take Arthur's straw mattress, and when he finally gets here, we'll have a proper discussion. So, see anything? No, nothing there. Hey, men! This way! I need some help! Where does that go? Outside. Yes, but where? Just trust me. And your brother? He should have been here by now. Sorry. Don't give up on him just yet. Shit. Stay down. He has a helmet. Ah! Oh. Devorantes. What? Devorantes. Saltpeter and alcohol. Burns your face and melts steel. No one can keep their helmet on with that. Get some ready. All right. Him right? It's easy. Try to be a bit more enthusiastic, will you? Yeah. 
Shit. Look. There's one with a helmet. You know what to do. Yes. Uh, any idea where the wet stones are? In one of the boxes. But it's an unholy mess in there. So you go first. Hugo, you uh, keep a lookout and stay quiet. All right. Understood. They're still looking for me. Was that noise? But I was sure 
Well, the bastion for interrogation. He should think himself lucky. If he didn't have information about the boy, he'd be little chunks of meat by now. So, still nothing? No, they're only kidding. Probably just hiding in the bushes somewhere. Well, there's a lot of men looking for just some kids. And the Grand Inquisitor is being pretty tough on Lord Nicholas. Oh, Nicholas is used to it. They don't call him the Scarlet Monk for nothing. That's an odd sound. Let's get out of here. Come on. Go ahead. So kind of you, Your Highness. Go on, get moving. What are you going to do to me? Careful, it's Lucas. The cart should be arriving soon with fresh supplies. They'll take you to the Inquisition Bastion in town. Amicia, do you have any Devorantis left? Yes, then go on. Knock his helmet off. that. And what about you, Lucas? How are you? Uh, can we talk while we run, or we can sit down with some wine and some roast chicken and wait for them to come and kill us? What do you reckon? You're right. Let's get going. The chateau shouldn't be far now. Let's go. Come on. It's not far to the aqueduct. Seems like you've been through some tough times. You don't say. You forgot to tell us about the Inquisition. You wouldn't have accepted the deal. The one where your friends are rich. Oh, we'll sort it out. Tell my brother that. What's all this? An accident? An Inquisition cart. The rats. There must be things we can salvage from inside. I don't see how we can get past. Oh, Amicia, I have something for you. It's a byproduct of Ignifure. Luminosa. You throw it into a pile of rats and... Anyway, you'll see. Here, take it. Salt, beta, alcohol, and leather. Mix them together. All right.
Throw it to the rats. Ah! Luminosa. Uh, my eyes stink. It completely destroyed them. Yaki Dog, we're nearly there. Finally. We're going to find out at last. I'll help you up. All right. Let's go up the Yaki Dog. Hugo, it's Aqueduct. Oh, Aqueduct. Aqueduct. <laughs> Nelly, where's your brother? I don't want to talk about it. Uh, all, all right. Well spotted. Come on, get up there. Yes. What? Is that it? There's nothing here. Lucas, I... Don't tell me we've done all this for nothing. No, no, no. Laurentius was smarter than that. It's an alchemist's trick. Gold is born from lead. The door shall only reveal itself to the one who has the key. Something like that. Mm. I prefer use your eyes before using your mouth. Who's going first? A nice one. Uh, Amicia? Come on then. We've come this far. That's my girl. Bad. Is that the sea? N no, it's water that's collected underground. Hey, there's a pontoon. People used to use I this place. Never heard of it. We're before. on the right track. And the chateau? Where is it? Well, if you want to know, we'll have to get across first. Ferry. A what? A boat that's propelled by a rope. Melly, can you look after it? Lucas, come and help instead of sleeping. Uh, yes, yes. The water's green. Oh, that's because there are a lot of things living in it. They must be very cold. Once, Father took us to the lake of Tuv, and I slipped and fell in the water. It was so cold it made me cry. <laughs> I would have cried too. <laughs> Your boat awaits. Shall I get in? Yes, Hugo, get in. I hope they can swim. Hold on tight. There you go. Whoa. I can't see any fish. Oh, that's because of the monster. What? A monster? Of course. The underground lakes are magical. Huge, ancient monsters hide in their depths. And watch out, they're very hungry. No, they're not. And if there were monsters, we'd see some big bubbles. <laughs> you got me. Mummy used to say that monsters are just those things, those things too. Just those things to which we have never given a name. She told me that too. I would quite like to see a monster, actually. Right, this is where we get off. Oh, it was too quick. I know, but it's someone else's turn now. There are no monsters here, but there might be a whale. <laughs> a whale is big, you know. Yes, but a little one. Why not? A shy whale that doesn't want to show itself. It's shy because it's small, <sighs> but I'm sure it's pretty. You can let 
Let's go. and Hugo might die. I was scared. I... forget it. It's all behind us now. But anything that takes my fancy at the castle is mine, all right? Fair enough. What were you saying? Things for grown-up ears. All right, let's keep going. Closed. Not for long. Make some room. It's done. Oh, there you go. Of course. I hadn't missed them a bit. What is this place anyway? It's... Oh, it can't be. I have to see this from closer up. The... That pit. What, Lucas? What's the matter? That hanging brazier can slide the length of the trench. Lucas, that one, the other way, and it's a defense system. Like a castle. Like a rat trap, protecting something. And? How does it work? Easy. The braziers push the rats towards the pit and they get trapped there. Could be useful. Who built it? I don't know, but it looks ancient. Come on, Lucas. Let's take a look. Right, Melly. While the boys are daydreaming, we should get going. Who built this? Some, uh, some knights, perhaps? I don't think knights know how to use stone and mortar. But craftsmen, there are a lot of those. Lucas? It was built a long time ago, but the rats haven't been here for that long. You're right. That gives me goosebumps. <laughs> to get to the other side. All right, come on. <clears throat> come, I'll get you up. Yeah. Do you think we could get that down? <laughs> All right, I'll take care of the door. Come on, cross over you two. The system very efficient. Let's go. <sighs> Follow me. Another door. Maybe it's the right one. I just hope there are no rats behind it. Melly, need a little help here. On my way. 
Come on! I'm starting to get fed up of all these doors. Look! We found it! The castle! Whoa. It really exists. Chateau d'Ambroche. It's amazing. But I had a moment of doubt, but that... That's the sort of alchemist legend I like. Come on, let's take a closer look. Incredible. That tower over there. It's the living quarters. It must be several centuries old. It looks like it's dry, but there's a pit in the way. It's full of rats. It's another trap. There has to be another way to get through. Locked. Can you take care of it? All right. This thing's really old. Oh, there was something alive in it. It's open. decided to meet here, it seems. Come on. The siege of Chateau d'Ambrage. Two girls versus thousands of rats. This battle will go down in history. Look, they're moving. That's a good first step. I'll let you go first, because rats are your thing. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Go on, I'm with you. Great, I feel better already. Melly to push that. like nobles at the king's court, but it's our castle. <laughs> right, those ones have to be driven 
into the pit too. And of course, they're on the wrong side of the brazier. I'm gonna have to go down and see what's there. All right, I'll cover you with the brazier. I'm putting my life in your hands, you know. All in a day's work, milady. Whenever you're ready. Think you can do this? Understood. Wow! It could do with a bit of grease. <laughs> Would you rather be down here? I'm fine. I'm just warming up. I'm at the end. What do you see? More braziers. I can get up on the ramparts. Go on then. We're going to make it. Hugo will be safe. We'll all be safe. Last sector now. I have to get back to the ladder. There are still rats down there. I'm going to need the brazier. All right, here we go again. Have you done it? Yes. Are you all right, Hugo? I'm fine. I'm listening to shouting. Don't worry. The storm will drown out our voices. Soon we'll all get to see the tower. too many books. I... Come on. We still have to clean up the area down there. We're going to need the brazier from the ramparts. I'll cover you with this one. All right. I'm going down. Uh, uh, what is it? Nothing. It's just a crappy hood lever. Melly, you always know the right thing to say. It's going to be all right. It's your castle. You have a connection. Our castle. 
Imagine, we could all live here together. I'm more of a cellar girl, you know. How am I going to get up there? No need a ladder. But the damn rats are everywhere. I don't know, Amicia the Amazon. Tell them a story. Very funny. our lives. Yes, Laurentius was right. To celebrate our victory, would you mind if we get out of the rain, please? Right, to the tower. Yes, come over to the fire and warm up. It's huge. We'll have time to explore tomorrow. This is our home now. Thank <laughs> you.